what's going on YouTube? One L E X from here. Today is a bittersweet day. This beautiful 1299 anniversary. It's getting put up for sale. Taking it to my favorite dealership on Inimoto to do a consignment with them. And one day it'll be in possession of somebody else. You know, I got this bike two years ago because it was gorgeous. You know, I loved the 1199 and didn't think the 1299 would be, you know, that much different of a bike. So I wasn't initially going to get a 1299. And like I said, this anniversary came out and I was like, oh my God, I think it's just gorgeous. I did some magic and from the deep of Florida and Tampa Bay, I had this thing delivered and I remember the day it came off the truck just beautiful broken mirror and all it was beautiful though and you know I put let's see how long 3700 miles on it so I mean it's been written a little bit for what it is and where I'm at you know I'm not a daily rider so to put that many miles on in two years it's pretty good so what's next where do I go from here um, well, I'm definitely going to have a, a twin in my life. I'm not sure which model. I do know that my goals lie in a Superleggera range. The uh, 1299 Superleggera is still a goal. Definitely a motorcycle I want to have and I am working towards getting. But also, on top of that, an H before race. I want to get a track bike, and I know there are way cheaper track bikes than HP4 Race, I get that. Uh, but the type of person I am, it needs to be just uh, from the factory a monster. And with everything that that bike has, it's exactly that. And I know I'm going to get flack by saying, well, why don't you get a 2020 S1000R? Great bike, fair point. I don't want it. <laughs> it's, it's just that simple. You know, I, I love numbered machines. I love the exclusivity of them. It's kind of an ego tickler, if you will. And, I, you know, I, it's just an engineering masterpiece with the carbon frame and everything else. That it's just like, fuck yeah. You know, it's what I want. And those two bikes combined are very expensive so it's like yes giving this up sucks uh, but the return that I'm going for is much bigger in scope on top of that uh, I need to buy an SUV my dogs are massive and putting them in a Hellcat and a Corvette uh, <laughs> well it just doesn't work very well so there's that and my wedding has proven to be expensive so there's a lot of life instances that come up and having some assets you can liquidate um, really help <laughs> with being able to pay for those things so today this is probably the last ride on this bad boy and it'll be off to bigger and better things how it is, what's life, it's a machine. While I love it, it is something I have to part ways with. That I'm going to part ways with. What the fuck? I'm going to part ways with. So, yeah, that's all my video is. Bittersweet moment, but uh, yeah, you all have a good one. I'm gonna ride this thing, see if I can out rear in people that are stopped at green lights. And uh, yeah, enjoy my day. You all have a good one.